Hi guys, so um, I'm actually editing this video and I just realized that I didn't film an intro for it. So this is gonna be my intro. Um, this video is basically just going to be um, my review and kind of first impressions of this purple shampoo, but I wanted to update you. It's been a couple weeks and I've continued to use this purple shampoo and it is now my favorite. It's amazing and it's kind of how I have been maintaining this like sandy blonde color that I have in my hair right now. I just recently went blonde and I've been struggling with like the brassy and yellow tones coming out in my hair and I haven't been able to find anything that's really worked well for me, but I found this conditioner or I found this shampoo and I actually think it might be on sale right now I got it on sale and I love it I highly recommend it so yeah if you're interested in seeing how I get my hair from like kind of yellow and brassy to looking more like this more of a sandy blonde color then just keep watching okay so as you can see my hair is pretty yellow it's actually a lot more yellow in person i feel like um the camera is actually kind of toning it down a little bit let me show you in the mirror and see if you can tell actually i'm just going to show you like this so i have some pieces that are lighter like a little bit lighter yellow and then my ends are a pinch darker or warmer and then the top layer is a little bit darker than some of these undersides. So I'm gonna see how well it does since I do have a few different tones going on here. Um, I did just brush my hair out by the way, that's why it kind of looks like this. So the first thing I'm gonna do is wet my hair and I'm gonna do that with warm water. Um, I'm hoping that'll kind of open up the hair cuticle and help it take the color a little bit better. So I'm gonna do that really quick. Okay, so I just rinsed it out and I actually went ahead and washed it with this kinky curly um, comb clean. It's a I think it's like a buildup busting type shampoo. So I thought I may have made a mistake, but my thought process behind using that was that it would kind of remove all the buildup. Build. So my thought process behind that was that it would kind of remove all the buildup that I have on my hair from all the hair products that I use because I do have naturally wavy hair. So I use a lot of styling products and um, I have like a lot of dry shampoo and stuff in my hair so I kind of wanted to get all that out before I went in with this in the hopes that this would like take to my hair better so I'm just gonna brush my hair out and I know some people um, with curly or wavy hair don't like to brush their hair when it's wet I've not had any issues with that my hair is extremely soft and it doesn't tangle very easily all right so now for the shampoo I'm gonna be using I don't know how to pronounce this name Lang Lange so that's what we're gonna be using. It's a violet purple toning shampoo. Um, my aunt is actually a hairdresser and she told me that I should potentially mix a blue with a purple since like I showed you in those other shots, I do kind of have some darker, well, that's really dark, some darker like orangey pieces, but I don't know, that just sounds like a lot of work. And I wasn't super impressed with that blue shampoo and how strong it was. So I'm just gonna go in with this purple one. And see what happens oh my gosh that's so dark i really hope this works so i'm just gonna do it with my hands i think and i'm not gonna take this up to my root because there's really no point so <laughs> it like sucked it all back up okay sorry oh my gosh this smells really good this is my first time using it oh my gosh <gasps> i'm getting purple shampoo everywhere I should probably clean that off. Wow, this smells so good. Oh my gosh, I'm excited. I hope this works. If this doesn't work, I am just gonna tone it, so it's cool. This stuff is very silky and it spreads really easily, so that's nice. But hopefully I won't have to leave a lot. This shampoo does not tell me how long to leave it on for. It just says to put it in my hair, lather, rinse, and repeat. Um, but I know that most of these like purple shampoos, you leave them on for like five minutes. This one girl said she leaves hers on for 10 and she got pretty good results. So I'm gonna try leaving it on for 10. If my hair goes silver or green, worst case scenario, then, which it shouldn't cause this doesn't have blue in it, but if it does, I'll just wash it a bunch of times, but we shall see. All right, um, yeah, I think I covered all the ends at least. So I'm gonna let this sit for 10 minutes and then I'm gonna come back. Wait, did I say 20? I'm gonna check it at 10, but I might leave it for 20. Let's see. 
Okay, so I it's actually only been like five minutes. I got a little nervous. Yeah, um, it definitely stained my hands purple. But I got a little nervous to leave it on for 10 since this doesn't even say to like let it sit at all. It says to put it on and then rinse it right back off. So I let it sit for five minutes. I'm gonna go ahead and rinse it and then see what happens. Worst case scenario, like I said, I am prepared to tone it anyways. So I'm not that upset if it's not um, a crazy difference. I should probably rinse that off. Okay, I'm gonna go rinse this out of my hair and I'll be right back. Oh, um, one more thing. I am just going to rinse it out with cold water. So, okay. So I just washed my hair out and I applied all my styling products. Um, like I said, I do have naturally wavy hair. So if you are interested in more hair type videos or even my curly slash wavy hair routine, um, you can check out the rest of my channel and subscribe if you want to. Um, but I am going to have a updated curly hair routine video going up right after this one. So if you want to see how I style my hair, you can go ahead and watch that video. But yeah, I'm going to let my hair air dry for a little bit and then I'll be back with the finished result. But it's already looking like really good. I feel like it's looking like pretty cool. So <laughs> cool. Okay, bye. Okay, so these are my final results. I think that this worked so well. I really love this um, shampoo. So again, this is the one that I used and it worked really well. Like I used a legit toner like from a cosmetology store um, and that toner didn't even work as good as this shampoo did. So I'm really happy with these results. Like all of the yellow is pretty much gone and the top of my hair was a lot darker than the underside of my hair and I feel like it kind of evened it all out and it's just all over like more cool tone. So I'm going to put in a few pictures too of the before and after.